Hi, this is Nikki and I am going to share, um, I've been asked to read letters number one and numbers 10 from the Divine Love Letter books I do. So this, is me this message is for those who are in a twin flame, soul to soul journey. And um, these are all channel letters that I do from tapping into the energies of your twin's high self or your high self or anyone that you want a message from. And so I'm going to, um, a lady asked for numbers one and number 10 to be read. So this is a message um, from through, through these letters, sorry, this is a message from your twin through these letters. So if you're watching this at the moment, this is the message they want to give you. That you are the most lovely divine flower. Your purity and your scent is both beautiful and intoxicating. I cannot wait to breathe you in, to cradle you in my arms and adorn you with the love that you so deserve. I have waited so long. We have waited so long. It's been a painful and hard, hard lesson to learn along the way. But I'm not afraid anymore. I'm not afraid to give my heart to you, to be an open book for you to read and understand every page. I want you to be my last and final chapter. I want our story to be a beautiful romance, a best-selling novel that will give people hope of what true love can do to change their lives. To live in love is to really live. <laughs> that is the, that's just crazy. Uh, I was gonna talk about the, um, twin flame love love story book that I'm doing and so this is a great chance to talk about it isn't it so thank you for asking for lessons one and ten um so yeah if you would like to share your tf story then I am starting to think about that again so I'm looking for a hundred t twin flames to share their story I'll send you a set of questions that will help you guide writing your story and um, and then I will be compiling it much like this book. So it will be basically an opportunity for you to share your story and um, share so that other people that are coming onto this journey can learn from that, you know, can learn from people's experiences and see that they're not going absolutely bonkers and um, to take lessons from it. But also a really lovely opportunity for you to have your TF story down um, for leaving a legacy of love to help others. So if you would like to be involved, then send me an email to divinelovecrystalgrid at gmail.com and um, put in the headline TF story. And then um, I just need your details at the moment, just your, your email address and just drop me a quick email just to say that you're interested. And then what I'll be doing over the coming sort of weeks is sending out a um, template for you to put in, answer the questions, which will help you frame your story. And then I'll be compiling them all and doing a book. So um, it's just so perfect that you asked for letters one and ten because there was, it was, talking about a best-selling book. Well, let's see. <laughs> And uh, so the next one, and so, and with that, um, it will be self-published via Amazon, but um, all of the proceeds of the book, I will, my sort of bigger aim is to do a, a retreat. And um, so all of the proceeds of the book would go towards doing a retreat. Um, but that's sort of like in the future. So, um, so letter 10 is this. I want to tell you that you are everything to me. You are my world, the engine in me that makes my heart keep beating, the tick in my clock. I love you with every part of me. I worship you with my love and cannot wait for the day that we can live this beautiful love affair out together. Living, loving, touching, feeling our way through this beautiful life to create the most wonderful life together. That is my dream. That is our agreement that we made with each other, that we would do this. This crazy life, we would make it together. A beautiful, peaceful, loving life. We will have a beautiful existence. Well, um, again, so lovely to look forward to that, right? And also, I really like the way it says peaceful. 
because it's none of this crazy, you know, trying to second guess what's going on and, you know, um, all of that, which this journey, you know, does make you do. The journey of awakening, the Twin Flame journey does make you think that you're going absolutely crazy. So, letter one from book two. Quite simply, you are the love of my life. My secret treasure. You are the greatest gift a girl could ever ask for. <laughs> you are all my dreams come true. My fantasy, my fairy tale, my love, my universe, my truth, my heart. I am overwhelmed with what our love has awakened within me. I feel like I've been given the key to the secrets of the universe and you are the one that gave me the key. My life will never be the same again. I know there's no going back. I know there's only forwards. There's only more adventures, more discoveries, more and more wonders of the universe to find out together. I love that we are each other's team. We make a team. <laughs> I have great because that's from somebody's higher self to their twin. So I love that. Um, okay. Letter 10 is, well, that's a silly question, isn't it? What do you think? Of course I am. That's the whole reason we agreed to do this whole insanely difficult and painful journey. The only prize at the end is living in truly ecstatic, blissful sexual ecstasy. Otherwise, why would we have chosen this life? Believe me, it is beyond what your mind can imagine. It is literally the most sublimely exquisite feeling that you can ever imagine your body to possess. Possessing each other's souls into our physical bodies and merging together is the most beautiful experience we came here for. <laughs> wow that well I guess yeah that's true otherwise why would we agree to to go through all of this <laughs> there's got to be some good returns at the end of it right so um that is quite uh quite something that letter <laughs> uh gives you definitely something to look forward to right so right letter one from book three that there's no doubt that we are what legends are made of. This love is going to blow everything else I've ever felt out of the water. I've thought I've been in love before, but seriously, that was just mamby pamby nonsense love compared to this. This is the real deal. It's like an explosion in my heart, an outburst of emotion that I didn't even know was possible. I mean... How could I feel that for a total stranger? But when our eyes met, bam, I was gone. Gone to a land of make-believing real. <laughs> uh, that is so cool. Um, it's just, so what I notice is this is written in massive letters, bam, bam, bam. And uh, I've just been to a sound healing gong bar session. And on the way back, um, there was this homeless guy and he was playing into, <laughs> it was really funny, bless him, he was playing into a traffic cone and he was singing into it and he was singing the Flintstones song, which of course the Flintstones has Bam Bam in it. <laughs> so uh, that's just a really nice little sync because uh, it just really made me smile because he was just such a lovely guy. Right, so um, letter 10. And it's from a child. So, I want to help you on your journey to love, to find true love and to unlock the secrets of what we came here for. We came here to be a union of love, a union of pure divine love, a love that this planet hasn't seen before. We are the new wave of love givers that are here to show the world that love really is the only answer. That love is the only reason why we come, to remember to love and to be love. It's not to try and be anything, but it's to remember the beautiful soul essence that we all are. We all come from the same source of a divine spark, and that is our journey, to find oneness with all. Oh, oh, oh. 
Oh my god, it kind of, it's, it's just, okay, I'm going to read that again, because that's kind of rounds up beautifully the entire journey, and again, just gives you, like, lifts up that love vibration and puts you right back into the zone. So, I want to help you on your journey to love, to find true love, and to unlock the secrets of what we came here for. We came here to be a union of love, a union of pure divine love, a love that this planet hasn't seen before. We are the new wave of love givers that are here to show the world that love really is the only answer, that love is the only reason why we come, to remember to love and to be love. It's not to try and be anything, but it's to remember the beautiful soul essence that we all are. We all come from the same source of a divine spark, and that is our journey, to find oneness with all. <laughs> well, there you go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful messages. And um, I hope they help you. I really do, because if you are feeling um, that you know, you're know you at a loss and you're at the end of your tether and you don't know if it's ever going to happen for your twin in this lifetime, then all of those messages are there to say you do have a divine purpose with your twin. And um, if it has, a, if it looks like that they've gone, you know, gone off and on a different path and it's not going to happen and you're thinking it's not going to happen in this lifetime and all of those things, um, then remember, it, we are creating our own reality. And of course, it is about having faith and trust in the bigger picture and trusting that the divine, the, you know, the bigger call of the divine purpose will bring you back together at the right time. And if it isn't now, then it just means that you're on your soul path still. Well, we're all on our soul path all the time, but it just means that um, you're doing your thing. And that's brilliant. And that's what you need to embrace and trust in the higher and the bigger plan. Because, you know, there's something out there that creates the oceans and creates the mountains and creates the air that we breathe and creates everything. The big creator. And so, you know you've met your twin that's the big thing out of like seven billion people you have met your twin who is the other half of your soul so if you just think about that and really think about it there is a divine reason why that happened so trust 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 it will all come back together when the time is right all right, well, I hope that helps. And uh, yeah, thank you so much to everyone that is coming to me for letters, healings, readings, um, because it is really an amazing, amazing, amazing journey. And uh, I just want to say thank you. All right, I hope you have a great evening or day or morning whenever you watch this. Okay, cheers, bye.